level, my name is James Sobalski. Ray, I guess with what we're about to see on the ice, international relations could be impacted politically here in the world with this one tonight. Wow, that sounds like a pretty big game, James. How's that for a sell? I'm just thinking when you play with your country's flag on your chest, everything is a little different. It means a little more. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. Puck is dropped and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. He's got a step. He scores! Boy, he didn't take much time at all. He was so tight to the net, and he makes a nice move to finish it off. That was filthy. Ah, this was my move, the old backhand deep. Fake the shot, go to the backhand, put it away. No chance for the goalie here. He's got the game's first goal here in the opening frame. Pretty tightly played game so far. Not a lot of chances, not a lot of errors on either team, but now we got one. Maybe the game will open up. Moves the puck. Let's it go, and there's the save. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Quick shot. He scores! Now you got to keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. Goalie gets a little bit of this, almost beat cleanly, but it's not going to matter. It's in the net anyway. Getting into the later stages of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And that puck leaves the zone. Team Switzerland's got the puck here in the open ice. Slides the puck to Niederreiter. With some... Scores! Quickly, two goals in right around 90 seconds. You take a timeout here on the other side. I would have taken one then, and I'd take another one now. That's a scorer's goal right there. That puck is on and off his stick in a hurry. He's so tight to the net, he has to get rid of it before the goalie can readjust. Switzerland's got the one goal lead here in the opening frame. Better to be ahead than behind, and the coaches are telling them that they want more aggression. They want them to play more in the offensive zone. Great defensive effort with the stick. That's a solid check on the play. Here's a short pass to Heischer with the stop. Wait, they're signaling a goal. It, it, it looked like he had it, but it looks like they're signaling a goal now. Now that's got to make him feel sick. He ends up depositing the puck into his own net. Wins it. Switzerland goal, scored by number 13. That's a good heads up play at center ice. The first period comes to a conclusion. 3 1 is the score after 20 minutes of play. If you like offense, well, that was a fun period to watch. Hey, man, now is the time to pick up your team calendars. You can pick them up. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. We're still in the early stages of this period. Been a pretty good offensive display, at least for one side. 3-1 is where we sit. A howitzer! He scores! Control of the faceoff by the offensive team allows them to snap it into position for the shot. The goalie's not set, and he gets beat on it.
Germany's back to set a race, and now it is just a deficit of one. What a difference just the one goal makes in the way that you look at the game, what makes you think is possible. They only need one more to even this up. Takes it across the blue line. Let's it go, and that one's turned away. Puck set across the blue line. He scores! They tied it up! Brand new game. All that work that's gone behind this, and we're back to even Steven. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. More than half the period has expired. We got a tie game. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Germany's looking to break out of their own end. Readers hauled down, penalty on the way. That's a solid hit. Breaks up the play with a poke check. Here comes the sentence. Tripped him up, and he's off to the box for it, Ray. Reaching out for the puck, you get your stick into his feet. This is the consequence. Here in the dying moments of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Takes the feed at the point. Team Switzerland's got a hold of it along the wall. All alone! Scores! Pretty deceptive move here. Short little breakaway. He makes no mistake. Once he gets into the clear, this is about two things. His speed to pull away and his calmness to make this beautiful deke to finish this off. Switzerland's got the lead here late in the second. Give me the strategy here now, coach. It's not to sit back on your heels. It's to get up and attack. Try and stretch this lead out while you have your opponent reeling. And he slides it quickly to Reeder. Lowers the boom with that hit. Tosses it to Siegenthaler. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. Pretty cut and dry with a tripping call here. Yeah, but James, every player argues the tripping call because you feel like your stick was in the right place and the other guy stepped on it. Never your fault. And it looked like there was some late moment lobbying there that didn't yeah, work. It doesn't work. No, though. none. Switzerland's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Mulgan's won the draw. And now he moves it to Kukin. Two minutes for tripping. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. They'll take a 4-3 lead into the room after 40 minutes. When the home team wins, you win $10 off at Rob's. When the home team wins, bring your tickets to any Rob's Sporting Goods for a coupon good for $10 off your next purchase of $50 or more. Tickets must be ready. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. Switzerland's got the puck behind the net. Scores! That's back-to-back, -back, Ray. Well, the, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. He didn't have much room up over the glove, but as soon as the goalie dropped into the butterfly, there was enough for him to put it into the top bin. Team Switzerland's insurance marker has really widened the gap here in the back half of the third. And now it turns into a little bit of a free-for-all. They're comfortable with their two-goal lead, but the other guys, you know they're going to be pressing the play, trying to get back in it. And a great save! Here they are on the attack. Slides it across, and that one's stopped. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal! The stick work and hands here are beautiful to watch. What a silky goal. He pulls a goaltender out of position. Team G 
Germany's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. That's excellent timing on that stop. They've got the lead. We're getting late in the game. You can't really give one up now. Here in the later stages of this period, Team Germany's trailing by one. Puck has dropped and we are back underway. Weber's got it in the defensive end. Looks to pass it to Siegenthaler. That's a really good play, James. You got the lead, it's late in the game. You just want to advance the puck forward. There's no need for a risky play. They've got numbers, it's a two on one. Moves with the puck in the corner. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Germany's offensive struggles have been the story tonight. Lots of chances, just not a lot of results. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Reimer's going to play it against the half wall and makes a save. That's all she wrote from this one tonight. That's a tough loss for them, James. I mean, they did a lot of things right. Their face-offs were good, a lot of details good. They just didn't get enough done to win. Can you see those positives after a game like this, though? Not right now. Maybe tomorrow. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night.